Hi everyone, welcome back to a new video. So today is the day 9 of our 30 days of JavaScript daily challenge. Now let's see the question what we have for today. Return length of arguments passed. So this is an easy level question. Now let's see what the question is asking us. So this question is a very basic question. In this what we have been told that we need to write a function arguments length okay such that it returns the count of arguments passed in it okay so they are saying that we have an arguments length named function and we need to return the number of arguments that is passed through it like um, we have a function okay and the name is arguments length we can just say it like this now we have be, this they are passing an argument here okay and what we have to do we need to return the length of argument that is being passed here okay now the thing is they have told us in the constraints that this arc is a valid json array so since it is an array what we can do we can just easily take the length right so what we will take we will do args dot length and we will return it this is only what we have to do in this question there is nothing else that we are supposed to do we just need to return the length of the argument we can take for example also just like here we have an array with 5 okay so the length of this argument is 5 right and when I take since this is an array I will be taking the length of 5 and it will be returning 5 only and here in the second example we see we have an empty object we have null and we have 3 as string here but these all are values right so basically our argument has the length of 3 so when we take the length of this argument it will be returning 3 only so what we have to do in this question we just need to return args dot length now let's move on to the code editor in the lit code so now let's see the code as i said that we just need to return the arguments dot length so i will be doing the same i will take args dot length and i will return it let's try to run the code now So the sample test cases are passed. Let's try to submit it. So this code has been accepted. That's it for today guys. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please let me know in the comments. And in order to continue with me in this journey of 30 days of JavaScript, you can subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification so that you will be notified every time I post a new video. Thank you for watching.